why is conditioning so important? Uh, well, for us, it, it's kind of twofold. Our strength and conditioning program is great because we see the physical change in, in just our human body um, of our guys. But for us, too, our culture is built in the weight room. So who we are as a program, who we are as a team, as a family, really happens by seeing the guy next to you work his tail off all year long. So for us, it's really, really big that we have this full off season now uh, to really continue to build on what we had last year and make us a lot better. Um, not only physically, but as a unit. Exhaustion makes cowards of us all. I think that's how the quote goes. Uh, if you're out of shape and you're not the strong, as strong as you can be, as fast as you can be, as in shape as you can possibly be, when that fourth quarter comes and it's a 10 to 10 to 12 ball game, and you've really got to dig deep and show what you've got, if you're not in the shape, in the correct shape to be able to perform those things in the fourth quarter, it's going to be very difficult on your football team. Now, I'm going to tell you guys now. If I get that DB to adjust his feet over one step, I win. But if I do this type of corny stuff, like all in his face, that little ugly, E Honda, ta 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 ta, that motherfucker hit you with 18 punches, right? So that's what you need to do is create a new line of scrimmage, right? So G is guarding me, get skinny and go. And we're on the field twice a week, um, working on our speed and agility. Uh, this time right now we are getting some conditioning work but a lot of what we're doing is learning how to control our bodies and, and make quick cuts and sharp movements when we're heavy legged when we're tired because we're lifting we're lifting um, from three to four and then from four to five we go right to the field so we're getting guys very very tired then asking them to do high intensity athletic movement uh, which is going to make us a lot better they were lateral fingertips through the back fingertips on the back okay what i want to see here at the top okay square hip off-season conditioning, it's like a, think of it like as your, if your season is a car, off-season conditioning is filling that gas tank. You know, it, it's so important that you have something to, you know, it, it's your endurance, it's your strength, it's, it, it, more than that, it also builds your, your willpower. He's got to step over! Jesse, you got to step over! All right, all right, you're clear, this group is clear, don't step around the back! Right now we're in the weight room for an hour, four days a week. Um, a lot of a lot of explosive lifting, a lot of cleans, a lot of box jumps, stuff like that. We're really working on, on adding muscle mass and developing fast twitch muscle. So for us, it's not not as much of a conditioning standpoint as how far can we run, how long can we go. That kind of happens by accident. For us, our big focus right now is we're going to lift the heavy weights at the right tempo, so we get a chance to develop and build that muscle tissue. Um, as we build muscle tissue, we want to make sure we're building fast twitch muscle, which means we're explosive to get off the line, we're fast with our hands. Um, basically the functional muscle for football. Great job, great job. We love to compete. Everything you will do, okay, will be a competition with us, okay? You're competing for a job, you're competing to win games, you're competing in the classroom, and you're competing against your best self. Okay, we only have four rules in this program. Number one, protect the team. Always, we protect our own all the time. Okay, number two, our best self. We found out some of that today. Good job. Good job. You always, always compete to be the best version of you you've ever been. Okay? If you hit that today, good. Tomorrow's standards got a little bit higher. Always, always compete to be your best self. Be early and prepared. You're doing a good job so far. Keep that up. Okay? And last one, have fun. Okay? I don't know about you guys, but I'm having a hell of a lot of fun right now being around you people. This is fantastic. This is what it takes. Working really, really hard. Okay? Together, people you care about. It doesn't get any better than that.